Hi guys, getting ready to see how the two of you, you and your partner are feeling right now. All right, if this can work out, we're gonna see the overall energy between the two of you, you, then them, and then the outcome. All right, the overall energy is the Knight of Swords. Okay, fast action, possibly fighting. You might be dealing with an air sign. You have the Eight of Cups, Nine of Wands, and the Five of Swords. They have High Priestess, Knight of Cups, and the Hermit card. Okay, so someone, it kind of looks like you, might want to chop somebody's head off with the Knight of Swords energy. That can be a very aggressive card. can also be acting without thinking, so careful of that. I see you're frustrated, Nine of Wands, Five of Swords. In fact, you may want to throw the towel in, Eight of Cups, and just walk away. Um, I just did a reading, and this these energies were in that one also. So I do feel like you're more frustrated than they are. Over on their side though, you could be dealing with a Virgo, but you have the Knight of Cups, so they could be also a water sign, but you have the High Priestess. I feel like this person has this very gentle energy around them right now. They are thinking things through. With the Knight of Cups, I mean, they must, they must still have love for you. Maybe they don't know how to communicate or resolve this either. Uh, they feel like they're trying to meet your needs, but they don't know how. High priestess okay they may withdraw especially if you're angry and they just don't know if you're frustrated a lot maybe they just don't know how to handle you they don't know what you want that's kind of what I'm seeing here let's see the outcome again Herman I feel like they may be withdrawing I don't think like they're ghosting you okay eight of swords they feel trapped in this relationship or you feel trapped hang man okay there could be new passion though okay so there's communication that needs to be had. It's kind of what I'm seeing here. Let's go to romance because maybe they'll tell us what it is. I think this can be saved. I think you're frustrated. Now, if you want to walk away, Eight of Cups, it is showing that you kind of are ready to just move on. But that could just be, again, that, that things just, you're tired of dealing with this. Um, yeah, they may be quiet, but there's definitely love still left on their side. They just don't know what how to fix it. Okay, romance card. Okay, now that's saying unrequited love. Okay, that's, I can understand. And engagement. All right. All right. So this one fell out. So definitely could be there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this going. And it, it may not be that it's unrequited. It could be just that there's just, well, Ace of Wands could definitely mean that you want more passion and possibly yes with someone new. Definitely. If one of you is feeling trapped, you can't fix this, you can't, you know, change it you're unhappy, nothing's changing, then yeah, then maybe it's time to move on. All right. Engagement, I have a couple feelings off this one. And I'm going to go back to this because I don't think you guys have to move on if you don't want to. Maybe someone in this relationship wants to get married and the other person does not. Maybe this is someone feeling trapped in a relationship, someone who doesn't like commitment. They feel trapped and suffocated. There, that could be the underlying reason the two of you are having all this drama in the relationship. It could be why your partner is withdrawing. You need to know intuitively that this could be what they're feeling. All right? Maybe they still just love you because it's showing here Knight of Cups. There's love for you. They just don't want to take that step of getting engaged or getting married. So you need to make that clear because that is truly how they feel. So can you live with that? If you guys communicate more, there's something here you do need to communicate about. I do feel your relationship could get stronger. It's either going to make it or break it. Either it's going to get stronger and you guys can move forward one more step and then you will, you will, um, like your relationship will ascend. It'll get stronger and better or you'll know, you know, this is not worth it. We just can't do this. My partner, I don't have the same ideas. I want marriage. They refuse. And so I just can't live with this. Or you want kids. They don't. You just can't make this work. Okay. I feel like they're not telling you something here. They're keeping it to themselves. They're afraid that you're going to do this and run toward them. Okay. That's, I'm definitely seeing that. So I feel your frustration though. I do. I feel your frustration here. So now if you guys were to split, this means something new would come in. You would, you would probably, you've been through the lessons is what I feel with this card. You've been through the lessons. You learned them. This next partner will be different. Um, you'll, you won't have to repeat the same patterns. You can move up. Um, the next one would be someone who has a lot of the same goals, ideas, things that you want also. And same for your partner. 
as long as they have under as long as they understood what they went through and learned the lessons and all that. But so you both could be happy with someone new if you guys chose to be. Under the deck right now, I do say see make the effort. So great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. So again, this could be with this partner here. I see this as being saved. I don't think you guys would have to split. I think I I think it'd be up to you. I see more you being frustrated and wanting to move on than your partner. So if the two of you decided to work it out, I could see definitely a new spark coming back into your relationship, new passion, being happy again, definitely. And if you feel like the steps you need to take is with someone new, you'll be guided and you'll have that great love that you want. So you, so I feel like for you guys, it would work out either way. Definitely. All right. Just, I feel like your partner's a little bit sensitive right now and they may not want to tell you something. You may not be, they may feel like you will fly off the handle and get crazy if they tell you this, um, secret. I think that definitely you're frustrated by this. You know this, you know, there's something not being said. So I'm going to leave it there. Have a great week and take care.